Hi everyone and welcome to Triple M Adventures with Bill. Before we get started, please consider subscribing to my channel and possibly becoming a Patreon. Now this video is a short video, it's an open TX1 and it's about aileron rudder mixing. Now what I wanted to show you is some aeroplanes, when you roll, use your ailerons to roll, it will just carry on going in the same direction. So as the aeroplane rolls, you need rudder in to kick the tail over. So aileron rudder mixing will allow you to do this. Now, I do it, tend to do it automatically with an aeroplane because I've been flying for quite some time and I will coordinate both rudder and aileron. But if you're not used to that and you've got a plane that won't respond the way you want it to, you can set up aileron rudder mixing. So let's have a look at the uh, computer and look at uh, OpenTX Companion and I'll show you how to do this and it's very simple. I've already made up a standard model. This is just a standard model with five uh, mixes with two aileron mixes. Now all we need to do is go to the rudder channel, whichever rudder channel you're using, and right click and say add. And then in here we are going to pick up the source aileron. So let's go down there to aileron. And then we're going to set up a weight. So what I'm going to do, let's say okay here, I'm going to go into the flight mode and I'm going to set a G GVAR up as let's say 25% uh, uh, and then I'm going to call this rudder aileron mixing and then we go back to the mixes and we edit that line and then we say the, the weight is GV, it's automatically picked it up because there's only one GV at the moment so we go OK and you'll see now it's sh sh we've got this mix set up. Now if we go to simulate, let's pull this up just a little bit, and then we're going to hit the model button, the model button. If we now use my aileron is here, and my rudder will be there. So there's my rudder. You can see channel four is working. But when I use my ailerons now, both my ailerons go, and so does my rudder. So there we go, that's how we set it up. It's not difficult at all. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you have any comments or questions, please leave them in the comments section below because I'd love to hear from you. Thanks for watching. Happy flying. Bye for now.